Hello everyone, I'm Sean Cheek and welcome to Easy Piano Lessons. Please continue to send all your comments and your requests uh, to easypianolessons at yahoo.com. Uh, that's also the way you can get all the part twos and threes to the, the songs on YouTube if they're not already on there. Um, <clears throat> this is a song that uh, was, was big when I was in high school, so I really remember this one. Uh, <laughs> starts again and there's some other parts to it and uh, you can get the, all the rest of that uh, at easy piano lessons at yahoo.com anyway let's start with right hand <clears throat> and I added a little bit uh, to what was on the recording because this is the way I would have played it uh, there's a, just a few notes I added so it kind of fills it out a little bit um, so let's start with an F here's middle C here's the next C and we want this F up here on the top for right hand and we want a D flat below that. So this black key is D flat. And we want an A flat below that. Here's A flat. Then the left hand is on a D flat octave. See, I have two D flats. And sorry for all the flats, but that's the key that it's done in. So I like to stay in the key uh, that the performer does it if I can. So D flat on the thumb right here. Here's middle C, so here's D flat, middle of the piano. And then this D flat right here on the pinky. Okay, so we're kind of high here. <clears throat> we want to play that all together. And you want to kind of roll the chord. If you want to just roll the right hand, this little squiggly line going upward, the air, upward arrow, you just roll it from bottom to top really quick, holding the pedal. If you want to roll the left hand in there with it too, that's fine. We want to roll the chord there at the beginning. Hold the pedal down. And then what we're going to do is continue to play the right hand notes, the thumb note on the A flat, and then back up to the F and D flat on the top back and forth. See that thumb, other one, thumb, and then we're going to do something else, but for this first little part right here, we'll play this together. All right, then we're going to have uh, the A flat and D flat again, but we're going to change the top note to a G flat. So here's G flat. So we're on all black keys on the right hand, and the left hand's going to play that <coughs> uh, D flat octave again with that. Okay, so play that together, and then the top note's going to go up to an A flat, so high A flat up here. Then we're going to play that A flat again, but what we're going to do is with the pinky play that A flat really quick, and then we're going to go quickly to this last chord, which is back to the G flat, D flat, A flat that we had uh, right here. I don't know why I put an arrow there, that should be a, a flat sign. Okay. So when you start right here with right hand, play that top G flat, not with your pinky, but with your ring finger. And then the A flat will be with the pinky. And then it's real quick. But um, So that's where you get that. It's called a grace note, but it comes really quick there. So this whole first box is, or I'm sorry, I should have rolled that chord. note out there, there is an F right here at the end of that measure. So when you start right here, it's and then an F there. I'll do this first box one more time. Together there. Alright, and this next box here, we have E flat on the top one right hand with a C below that, with an A flat below that. 
left hand has the same D flat octave, so play it together. And then we're going to go back and forth with that same chord like we did here at the very beginning. So play the thumb A flat and the other two. Back to the thumb A flat while you're holding the pedal. Alright, so from right there again. Alright, then we're going to play that chord all together again. So E flat, C, A flat, together with the left hand D flat. And then right hand's going to reach up for a high A flat up here, two of them, two A flats. And then down to a D flat right here. So this box goes. Alright, let's move up here to finish. We have a G flat on the right hand above middle C, then a B flat above that. D flat above that. Play it together with the same left hand D flat. I was out of room here to put the D flat, but it's the same thing on the left hand. So the D flat octave again, play it together with the right hand. And then we're going to do that right hand thing again where we go back and forth between the thumb and the other two notes. And then we play the whole chord again together with the left hand D flat again. And then right hand's going to have an E flat above that. And right here's a quick note again, a grace note, but um, real quick, E flat to F really quick. So E flat F, so this whole box sounds like this. And again, I left the last note out. I don't know why I did that. There should be a D flat right after that. Maybe I should put it here. So right after that F, you have a D flat. Let me do that box again. This last uh, box here we have <clears throat> E flat and C below that and A flat below that. Actually it's the same chord we had right here. Okay, and then we play the left hand D flat octave with that chord and then continue with the right hand going back and forth between the thumb and the other two and then you just hold that out. Now <clears throat> when he starts the verse and the singing we're going to start back here but let's move everything down an octave. So instead of being up here, let's come down here to more where we're used to playing the piano when we start the verse. So we look into my eyes, you will see. Up here now. What you mean to me? Oops, I played the wrong chord, but uh, to me. And come back again and do it again for the third time. Still down here. Such a heart. Such a soul. When you, let me come up here. Find you there. You. And I'm going to show you what's next here. I have a little less than two minutes, but I think I can fit it in. All right, let's fit this last part in. This is at the, when he goes through the verse the second time, and he goes, You said. And we get to the next part after that. But uh, So the second time through the verse, which is the third time through on the first board when you're down here in the middle of the piano, instead of doing that end part, uh, when you go, when you find or find me there, and you're going to do this chord on you'll search. You'll search no more. So here's the word you'll right here. We have G flat, B flat, D flat in the right hand. So here's G flat below middle C, B flat above that, D flat above that. Now the left hand's going to change off that D flat we were on for so long and move down to a low G flat. So here's a G flat on the thumb, G flat on the pinky. Play it together. Just one time, just a quarter note. And then we move to this box and we have the uh, D flat chord that we've had for a while. So F on the top, D flat below that. A flat below that. Left hand's going to move up to an A flat. So you were here, move up one black key to thumb on A flat, pinky on A flat, play it together, and then go back and forth between the thumb and the other two, back to thumb. So, you search no more, and the word more happens right here. And that's where you have a E flat above middle C with the middle C, A flat below that. Left hand's Left hand is still on an A flat octave. Uh, sorry about my kids there, they're a little loud sometimes. Alright, A flat on the, the thumb together. And then uh, 